Hey guys, how's it going? So today we're going to take a look at Pirla, and I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly, although I am probably not. Um, Pirla Pilsner from Poland. And this contains 6% alcohol by volume, and it is a 1 pint 0 0.9 fluid ounce bottle. Now, I just did a review on the Pirla, and that's what I'm going to call it, um, Honey Pilsner. And to be quite honest with you guys, and this might be a spoiler alert if you haven't seen that video yet, it was okay. It didn't exactly set my world on fire, but it wasn't terrible by any means. I also mentioned in my last video that this brewery has been around since 1846. So it's got a little bit of longevity to it. So how does original Perla taste? Mm. Sorry guys, it's kind of, it's kind of smooth. It's got um it's got a, a hint of dryness to it. It's pleasant tasting. It tastes much better without the honey, I have to say that. Um, it definitely tastes similar to the honey beer, but tasting it without the honey definitely is better. I can taste a little bit of fruitiness, and there's a lot of sweetness to this. It's still a very sweet tasting beer. It's, um... It's honestly pretty decent. I don't know if it's my favorite, but it's reasonable. Yeah, that's not bad. It's really not bad beer. So I would probably say this is upper middle of the road. I wouldn't, it wouldn't be the first thing I would suggest. But if you want to try it, I would go for it. I don't think you're going to find it to be really a terrible beer by any means. If you like a beer that's a tad more sweeter, then this is going to be for you. It's going to be right up your alley. If you like something that's a bit more dry and that has a bit more of a bitter taste, this isn't your beer. So um, that's going to do it for me for this one. So I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and have a great rest of your day.